So, hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I'm in a different setting because basically me and my sister were filming a video for our joint YouTube channel that we've started up recently called Static. The link will be down below. We're filming a video for that so make sure to go and check it out because it's a really fun one and it's basically a spooky channel. Today I'm bringing a bit of a different video as I'm bringing actually a haul. Um, so I went shopping on Shein. I brought quite a few things. So I'm basically today going to unbox them all for you. So when I say I got a lot, I got a lot. <laughs> so I'm going to be putting the prices somewhere of these items, but I honestly am very excited to get into this because this is a lot of stuff that I brought. By the way, I think the way they pack them is so cute. Like everything, I mean, it's not ergonomically friendly, but the way that everything comes in a bag, I think that's really nice. I've had a bit of a style change recently. So my style's kind of gone a bit more abstract where it used to be very like trying to be like, with the trends and, and now I'm like, you know what? Give me colour, but then also let me have a full black day. Let's just, you know what? Let's just do whatever we want, YOLO. So I actually ordered these in two separate like orders. I ordered one and then I was like, oh my gosh, I should do a video on this. So I ordered a bunch more stuff that I'd been wanting anyway. So I did actually open the first thing because it was in the first parcel and it wasn't until I opened it, I was like, oh, this would make a fantastic video idea. So this is the first thing I got. So I got these trousers and they're like shorts that are like buckled on so you can like unclip the bottoms and take the bottoms off. Uh, they're really like cool and I thought they were quite edgy and then with some fishnets underneath I thought they looked pretty cool uh they're very different when I got them out of the bag I remember not expecting them to be this kind of fabric I think I almost thought that they would be like a wool like a cotton fabric like a jog joggers fabric but they're not they're like they're like rough like a I used to have trousers like this when I used to go to dance and they'd have a lining in them. But they are still quite comfy um, to put on and they do fit really well. And I got these in a large. Everything I've got is in a large. My only fault that I would find is this bit here. Because it's not like a thick one. It's just like a thin thing. This pulls out so easily. Like you can see I'm barely touching that. Do you know what I mean? So that is the only problem with these. However, we are going to put a tack in them. Well, so I haven't actually fully seen these tops. I've seen them in the packagings, but I remember just seeing these tops on the website and being like, I want these so, so badly. So the first one, I've got no tops like this at all. So again, it's in a large. So this is like a bright yellow top like i'm loving yellows and oranges lately like, but this has like got those racer sleeves and it's actually a crop top but it's not super short so it's quite nice you can tuck it into some black jeans uh which is really nice and i think this would look so good with these trousers and yeah it's really nice and it comes really high neck up the only thing i would say is the way that they've cut these shoulders they do stick up a little bit which can get a little bit annoying, but I'm sure once you wash it, it'll shrink a little bit anyway, so it's not too bad. But that was super nice. And again, super cheap. The fabric on this actually feels like such good quality. It's a little bit sheer, but nothing that's like super drastic. But yeah, it's really soft and really good fabric. And I'm really happy about that. What have we got in this one? I can't remember what this is. What did I order? This was in the first order as well, though. Oh, I 
I remember what this was. I actually got this to go with those black trousers because I saw the model wearing it on their website and I was like, that's not a top I'd usually go for, but I like it. And it's literally just a white crop top that says, weird flex, but okay. <laughs> and I, I don't know, something just drew me to it. Like, I really liked it. Like, I'm loving all this alien stuff right now as well, like alien tie-dye. But I didn't manage to get anything. But I probably will buy one. But I just love this crop top so much. And I just thought it was so quirky. And it is something that I would say because I talk nonsense. Uh, and again, that was in a large. And I, it's really soft. Again, this is a little bit sheerer. Like, I, you can't see it on camera. So this is my latest order. So I've literally not opened any of this. So this is all really exciting and really new. We're going to start with these that I brought. So I've been loving sunglasses. And, and I saw these glasses that I really wanted. And I thought, oh, they're really nice. And then when I opened the box, they come in a case. <laughs> I was like, well, this is bougie <laughs> for Shein. So this is the glasses that I brought. They are so quirky. I love them so much. The only thing that I've just noticed as I scrape my hand is the ends are like really rough. This one more so, but they're really rough. Um, these are what they look like on though. They're meant to sit on your nose. They look a bit wide for my face, but I could totally see me going out rocking these. They make everything look red. They remind me of, can anybody remember the blue and red 3D glasses? That's what they remind me of when I look through them. I feel like I'm in some kind of alternate universe. But yeah, they sit like that. And these weren't much. I want to say these were only like three pounds. So this first top, I actually got to go with one of my pair of trousers because again, I saw it on the model. So this is the same material as the Weird Flex But OK t-shirt. And it's, it's a bit more like Lycra, I want to say. But it's really cute. And again, it's a crop top. But I loved this top so much. Again, I saw it on the model. And this says 90s, baby. And yes, I may have only been in the 90s for five months. <laughs> but I was technically a 90s baby. The 90s newborn. <laughs> then the next t-shirt I got. Oh, I've got so many bags around me. It's actually a long sleeve one. Because I wanted to see what this long sleeve fitted like um this is a proper like choker neck so this goes all the way up so i'm gonna choke what the hell does that say it's creased to high heavens still dreaming <laughs> so <laughs> the writing's really hard to like comprehend but i love that um and the sleeves are the sleeves are really long like really long uh if you're a bit taller and have a slightly longer arms that might be something that you want to know i'm just hoping like i say um these are all in large and i'm just hoping that fits my arms because so then we're going on to trousers so these ones that i've seen on and off um before on their site and i wanted them and i thought shall i buy them shall i do you know what i mean but I, this time I was just like, just get them, just get them. <laughs> they are the most extra trousers. Oh, saying that, white tees to the next bit. <laughs> but these are some of the absolutely coolest trousers I think I've ever seen in my entire life. Like, I mean, I don't know when I'm gonna wear them, but they are so cool. Like, honestly, they're sick. And they have pull strings at the bottom so you can pull the ankles, which obviously I'm going to do. But, like, they're so cool. I mean, I don't know if they're going to fit. They look very small. <laughs> but I love them, honestly. The fabric is like a rain mac fabric. <laughs> So you know those pack away mats that you can get and the really thin rain mat coats? That is the fabric of them. So I would potentially wear shorts underneath these or something. 
but I think they're perfect for summer. Um, even though here in England we don't get very good summers. Now, this last pair is my absolute favourite because I wanted these for the longest time. So the first time I downloaded Shein, uh, before I lost weight or anything, I remember seeing these and I ummed and ahed and I was like, look, you ain't gonna wear them. I think it was like last November or something and I really wanted camo trousers and I ended up just going with some basic green camo trousers, which I'll try and find a picture of if I can find one. But I was like, you know what, just get these basic camo trousers. I wore them for a little bit um, and they ended up being one of my favourite pairs. I just kind of got bored of the basic camo. Like, I love camo, but I got bored of it. So I thought, you know what? Seeing as we can't leave the house, what better time to order the most obnoxious camo trousers that you can find on the internet? <gasps> They're so bright. Oh, right, I didn't expect them to be this fabric. I expected them to be the fabric like the other two pairs of trousers. But they're not, they feel like a jean fabric. And these weren't that much money neither. Like, they were really cheap. They are sick. They are so cool. They smell a bit weird. You won't want to go to laser quest in these. Let's see you coming. But, oh, they are so wicked. Look, honestly, these are some of the coolest trousers I think I've ever seen in my life. And that's not exaggerating. I'm very, 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 very excited. <laughs> so I hope you enjoyed this video being a little bit different. Let me know if you want any more hauls. Make sure to go and follow my social media at GCJ99. And also make sure you also go and follow me and my sister's joint uh, Instagram and Twitter at Sisters Static, Sisters with a Z. And also check out our YouTube channel, Static. But for now, from me, see you later, guys. Bye.